guys welcome back again to another uh, finding best apps for the android phones and in this series we are going to we'll be discussing most of the times like uh, which are the best apps for a particular kind for example uh, today we are going to look on the some of the best file manager app that we have here so if you just type on the file manager and we can see a lot of apps here the most important nowadays uh, it should be easy integration of cloud services for example the uh, imported ones are google drive a dropbox box or amazon drive whatever you can think of and we are talking about this four and why four because this already separate video i have made here the video title and uh, link in the show notes you can check that so now the only question is which app we should try as i said a lot of stuff so i have here a uh, five uh, actually i downloaded 10 uh, but right now i am we will discuss five here in the next video we will discuss the furthermore five so let's quickly jump in and the first um, we have here is called the file manager is from genui asus computers and you can see uh, it's got a good number of downloads it's 10 million so let's open it here so i have been use all the apps here uh, for more than months because all of them are purpose i as i said before i used to upload my videos from the app uh, since my computer is old so i don't rely heavy on that i'm not relying actually so i used to shut them down so after editing i used to copy her and uh, i do lots of copy taking screenshots and you know, copying to pc for editing in adobe photoshop then coming back to this phone and stuff so here's the one you can call ss genui so my observations are it's simple and smooth and it's detecting the usb but unable to explore the files in some cases where uh, for example, uh, I got there here this USB OTG cable. It's a 16 gigs of fan drive. Let me just insert it there. So you can see uh, it's not able to detect, uh, even though it just did a refresh. Uh, but it's detecting, but it's not able to you know show the files there exactly. Uh, it's zero. If I use some other explorer, for example, uh, let me try some other. So if you get it to OK, uh, that means uh, this will exclusively access that but uh, this our asus genui is not asking for any permissions uh, like to, to access all the usb storage so kind of stuffs are there so you need to some do some lot of configuration that's why it's not simple one and if you just eject it here so it gets removed so even though this showing all the, these stuffs but i don't understand what is the reason behind uh, i never heard about this you know, exclusive giving rights to access so anyway uh, this limitation of that one okay and the next feature uh, it supports onedrive dropbox google drive for example you can see i can easily add uh, it supports google drive onedrive dropbox and yandex already i have configured my uh, onedrive and cloud storage is simple uh, smooth and accessing interface just click on in the your drive email address and it will show you all the files no problem easy accessing files no issues on that and uh, it would be nice if you know the cloud folders are definitely shown up in this somewhere else here so like the local storage and tools and uh, similarly we should be seeing some cloud storage because swiping here clicking again and displaying sometimes takes time so it should be directly visible here it will be most recommended and it has no recycle bin as you can see i got only the few of the internal storage network places and onedrive uh, only three and here you can see not much option is just in terms of contradiction and here you can edit categories also you cannot show the drive folders here so it's simple one no issues and that uh, if you are a simple user who likes the simple stuff you know watch, uh, exploring the files and all and dropbox integration and everything that's it so you can pretty much go with that no problem it doesn't have also the advanced features like android tv shares and share nearby etc these things are not there so let's jump to our second so now the recommendation you can easily recommend it uh, in case you as i said you're looking for normal features no hippocamp and high quality you know android beam and nfc share so this is simple just explore add your drive and go ahead so also it has uh, one important point i missed to tell uh, this pc file transfer it is uh, among the all five this is the only one that uses http protocol and it's simple why because using this http protocol if it is http based you can access directly from you know uh, your computer and also you can access files uh, uh, from your uh, you can see um for a windows phone that supports any of the browser so you can access from them all and all of the others uh, file manager that we have they use uh, ftp service so that needs computer and uh, that's sometimes not painful you cannot work with the browser you need to depend on the explorer so this is all and now come to our second and our second is here it's called the file manager uh, from the movie systems i i, I show some editor choice i all right so this is a paid one a lot of the features uh, come to the paid and it's somewhere near around you know uh, five to six dollar between so it's kind of costly it's not that simple to 
come to the home here it looks i actually i changed the theme uh, that's the limitation of our earlier asus gen ui because the, you cannot change the theme there because somewhere i like the black and maybe you too and you can see you go to setting you can option the change here and here the features wise i added uh, come to the here look uh, add account you can see suppose amazon cloud drive box dropbox so it has uh, i guess the most number of one that i have found in uh, among the fives this is nice uh, i added uh, two of them that i use this is how it looks like and let's see whether it's detecting the our you know usb drive if i just plugged in my usb drive here and it does it doesn't show here so even though it doesn't detect it at all so i don't know uh, maybe if you just explore it to singly it should take so this is how you yeah, safely eject it so it's not detecting no problem so it has the uh, some of the feature as i said it's the premium first feature uh the favorites is go to the premium recycle bin other premium so definitely if you buy this app you will get a lot of features secure mode is there but uh uh, they need to configure somewhere i don't know uh, it's not taking some pins i typing so need some extra bit of configuration and yes it shows you as i said in the favorite it shows your uh, cloud drive storage and everything so this is nice you don't have to swipe each time to a hamburger and ftp it doesn't have the http protocol it supports ftp uh, also you will see a lot of annoying pop-up ads and as i said uh, app should be simple uh, you should go to you know not everybody understands how to what is server and what is ftp ftps i don't know i know this is ftp secure mode and uh, it also got sftp and username password so a lot of rattling are there so not everybody does all these things here and uh, local network also uh, it shows all the uh, you know relevant protocols ips so this one has a dot 627 and so if somewhere i see so it is not showing the dot 27 because all of my connected to the little local network and they have got the static ips so it's also not working not worth in terms of free one and other stuff pictures and all it will show but this ads will always come so really i don't like that so that's how you say you can use your google gmail or facebook or separate email authentication to log into the account so this is there pretty much uh, all the stuff that you can add here so you can add OneDrive cloud account. So uh, in terms of paid, if you're looking to buy something, so you can, if you purchase that, definitely you will get a lot of features. As you can see, uh, most things are paid. And also secure mode is paid. Uh, no no transfer to PC, unlike we have here. And uh, in, in the previous UI, direct one click and share. So it's not working as it has FTP configuration. So I don't know, it's not recommended for the general purpose. I don't know all the stuffs. And so that's it. Uh, for the free one, it's not recommended. Coming to the new, fee, new file manager here. Uh, let's check first the fifth one uh, is the called file manager from the zira mobile and it's a 10 million 4.3 so open it here and up here is here in front of you so also you will see a big big ad sometime you know they are giving full time full ad so uh come to the backup here and they also support not every drive ad they just support google drive dropbox they don't have one drive if you're a kind of person you know who use a lot of stuff for the windows 10 for example if your laptop has a windows 10 and that, that works fine with the one drive there so uh that this file manager might not be suitable if you're using amazon cloud drive yandex and all box if you support so it's not supporting all these things so definitely it's not recommended in terms of cloud user also uh they shows the applications here this is nice actually uh, they have built-in application manager but anyway not everybody uses all day this app manager sometimes they use in a day or two so this is not a selling point of this app also backups you can take backups here and uh, they are show only one upgrade to version they give ad free only they have different different in-app purchases ad free premium you can add cloud storage and upcoming feature and uh, sorry this one so uh, definitely i'm not going to look for that so this is the file manager that looks like screenshots a separate folder that shows their system memory it shows all the stuff so pretty much not uh, things that you know uh, that can appeal to us so definitely i don't like this so i'm not going to recommend that and no pc to transfer to pc in ftp feature as you can see there's nothing when you can use that so it's not recommended and uh, guys just a simple file manager nothing else and our next is file manager hd file transfer this is from the cheetah mobile uh, that has you know uh, the clean master app you might have used so 5 million rated, not bad not too good because already i've seen uh, uh, files explorer with 50 million more download and had 4.5 rated so let's open and see this is how you will get and uh, 
then but one of the best feature i like here they shows all the recent files and folders this is very nice you don't have to browse for suppose for example you just just took a couple of the pictures as you can see here and if you're just going to browse and share so definitely you don't have to navigate to all folders you can simply get it here so this is how these things are there also it has a uh, light and dark theme so i have changed it there so this is a good point here transfer to feature feature is there transfer to pc but it's with ftp as you can see it use ftp so you have to use the windows explorer for example uh, and it's my computer you open and that is why you have to type all those things uh, you can use the, the browser and you can do all the stuff here uh, either at the end i will show you guys exactly this is genuine file transfer this is really nice and uh, you can directly upload and do there it's kind of very good way that that's why i said it's very good recommended and uh, now coming to this again uh, this supports uh, the cloud here and there is some problem i try to add a lot of times with them with my google drive uh, suppose if i just selected here and uh, i select my email here it's not showing up there i don't know what's the problem it's not came here you see uh, it's not showing so some weird issues and uh, no recycle bin here too or they have storage analysis but that is not uh, also an appealing point to you know to go ahead with this app definitely not recommended uh, in case you are kind of person so fine with that if you have that no issues on that and library you can make it there that images folders audios that everybody shows there are no issues bookmarks you can create tools and home click here you get stuff browse here yes same uh, that the storage analysis come with here itself so nothing else nothing new and root explorer needs root access they have this root explorer feature but they need root access also i've shown you i'm not able to add my google drive so this kind of limitation here uh, it's definitely i can recommend it but in freeware you will get uh, you know with uh, not much features so okay uh, if you are as i shown you guys exactly my google drive is not taking here so i don't know maybe i will uninstall and install but they suppose all the box dropbox yandex but they don't support amazon google drive so no issues on that now we will see our next file manager here uh, it's called the es file explorer that you might have used as i said it's a 100 million download four or five rated but that's why one point point i said uh, uh there may be a lot of features but not you will use all features I, I can definitely say that this is the uh file explorer that gives a lot of features and uh, uh definitely even if you have used you might be using that so uh but anyway it's not that simple to for example changing the theme sometimes get problem and it's never in a simple dark theme you have to get and configured and select and edit it there so so many stuffs here you will get lost sometimes so also it supports most number of the cloud storage if i say here come to the local this is a local this is a favorite and network cloud plus so this is the most one it shows uh, 10 uh, it shows bedu and mega cloud media fire and pretty much these things are common this is amazon also this is the one have the most number of cloud features on that so definitely if you have all these things you can go ahead with that and they have built-in cl cache cleaner too that's really nice uh, you can use that you can go to the cleaner uh, they have some built-in cleaner apps so it's nice no problem with that it shows sd card analysis there but yeah i need to struggle a lot to share transfer my files to pc and uh, they have some gesture base it's really nice root explorer need root access so show hidden files it shows there so definitely this is the uh, app which has a lot of features but uh, if you really want to change with that so at the end i will recommend to use asus gen ui it's not a problem because this is simple the first feature is there is very simple clean transfer to pc works uh as i shown you guys with the http stuff here's the image you can see uh So as you've seen, you, know, you can use directly explore and close everything there. So it's kind of nice. Uh, I said others are file managers. They have some have, they don't have this feature and some has this, but I need to struggle a lot, you know, to share my file. It's not simple. Anyway, uh, it depends on you yourself. I have explained and shows all the cons and pros of all these file managers. So I will come back to the next video for all the next five remaining. So guys, and if you like this video, give me thumbs up and also you can uh, suggest me and comment me on my Twitter uh, at the GI support or on the YouTube channel itself. And I will talk to you very soon. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching again.